Hey everyone, I'm Bill Walk. I'm a Memphis trial lawyer, but I'm also a writer. And recently I wrote a novel called Holes in the Souls as Gucci Loafers. Uh, it's about a fictional trial lawyer here in Memphis uh, with several biographical elements to me. And, and it's, a, it's set here in Memphis, Tennessee, and it's surrounding an interesting case I had a few years ago. Uh, the goal was to put the reader in the shoes of a real life trial lawyer and experience those kind of ups and downs that you experience along with it. It's a ride that much like our lives goes up and down and roller coasters and unexpected twists and turns. And so really the, 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 the story is about two weeks before the biggest trial of his career, main character is Ben Jennings. He finds out that his now former law partner had stolen millions of dollars from him and his clients and his whole life is put in uproar. He's also dealing with an ex-wife, he's dealing with two children, one of which has severe emotional problems. And he's trying to hold everything together and face the enemy, which is uh, the large medical establishment and their attorneys and everybody that's going against him. Uh, it is a really difficult case and the character in this case has dyslexia. And one of the things that comes out is how this dyslexia affects him and trying to handle the case. Uh, and Ben Jennings is driven by the need to protect his new client, an innocent baby. Ben discovers that what he perceives as a lifelong weakness is dyslexia, the wrong side of the track's upbringing and actually his strengths in bringing justice to this lady. Uh, we stroll down in this book. I wanted to bring out all of Memphis. We go to the tree-lined streets to the hood, to the barbecue joint pains in, in South Memphis, to the cozy corner to the barbecue shop. Uh, it's, a, it's a travel log, it's a food log. Uh, it is a love letter to my city. It's also a love letter to trial lawyers everywhere. And I wanted to give a unique look behind the curtain to this exotic city, uh, kind of an interesting story, and really just a, a fun, fun read uh, for people that I hope they enjoy it. Uh, you will like the cast of characters, and if you're a fan, if you like Scott Turow or John Grisham, I think you're probably going to like this book. So I hope you enjoy it. Thanks.